you practice this jam, understand the line of the hand is so important. When you pan come along, you jam, you jam, you jam. Now imagine when the hand in that you jumps, what happened? It's broken. If I gonna chop this like this daily, you gonna mess around. I gonna make sure I gonna chop your home up. If you understand, you pull the pan fits boom here, and then I go pang like that on your neck. Your head gonna be rolled down the floor. And this is why the Wing Chun we doing is so important. Important in such a way that the line of the hand. If you attack coming in the line, then it's easy to work because I can't jam. This is why you're working with a punch, chop, and palm. Do you understand that? We'll come back with that later. What we gotta do is get your back over there and practice some punching first to make sure the ways this is just laying in the power of the fist, the hand. Need to turn with the ways to make sure that and that lock together. If you have the power, but the ways is not in line, then you can't do anything. So move it! Look at this eyes. And practice the triple punch. The whole idea of the punching as you punching the the medicine ball to keep the movement in is learning the ways, the hand, so everything got to coordinate together. If the punching power, the fist strong, and the ways don't join together, then you can't get up any power. You understand that? So the length of it, you learn to understand it. Oh, so that twisting a little bit. Now get on with it. And I'll get some pad out for you to join. It's all from that conditioning. You've got to practice this like a thousand times just so you can get it right once. It's easy on the spot. That's when you're moving around, I think it's going to be a bit of a bit difficult. Okay. The movement on it, it's not that understanding how to the line of the hand company. So what we got to do, this company sponsor us some new equipment. So we're going to test them out a little bit on there. So hopefully that you can understand it more. So you put it on, okay. test out the punching. Mm -hmm. Now when you're punching, make sure you punch, punch, punch. And even pack got to be quite good. Because otherwise when you want to use it, you can't use it. Do you understand what I'm saying? It's hard. So make sure you hit them <laughs> properly. Do it properly with a hand. Keep your hand in like that. That in control. Line. One, two, three. Here like that, yeah? <laughs> Ground yourself with more. <laughs> Here. <laughs> now. So when it release the movement, copy. <laughs> yeah? Line. <laughs> Lead. <laughs> now, yeah? Come back there. Let's get the movement in a little bit. And practice. Up and down this size. Same thing. Same thing. Go! with that when I come back and see you a minute. That's pretty hard, isn't it? Went first. Your hands a little bit. <laughs> This is not up to the line, this is still part. When you start practicing, your fist have been strong enough. Later on, you'll be able to punch things. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. At the moment, your fist is not strong enough to punch anything. This be, is very soft. I don't think I'll be hitting any tiles anytime soon. So later on, you're gonna have some more stuff there to make sure that fist is right. You understand? So get on with it again. And let's go. And keep practicing. Go. 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 Go.